Good morning, everybody. Happy Thursday. I'm much more awake than I normally am, or have been the past couple of days. Anyway, so that's nice. Today's a neat day. I brought overnight oats for breakfast with some fruit, and then for lunch I made this pasta, veggie sausage, and veggie type meal. I'll take pictures. I'll show them to you guys later, of course. That was I just kind of threw together um, last night because I didn't know what else to make for lunch. So that's what I'm doing for lunch. I'm gonna fill my water bottle. Already taken my full body picture. Gotta edit my vlog. Gotta get to work. I have a lot to do today. It's gonna be great. <laughs> I've been kind of thinking about some things I want to do for my channel. I think I want to start doing like short videos answering questions from you guys with just like one or two questions. Posting them on my um, Instagram channel and my YouTube channel, of course. And um, I don't know. I have some things in the works that I really want to work on for you guys because I think it would be good to do like a mini series kind of not my vlog but a mini series and the thing is finding time to do that because i feel like i'm always so busy or don't have time to sit down and actually record things like that but um i wanted to do that and i want to get back into making sure my recipe blog gets posted every day or every other day i want to start posting my workouts i have a lot i want to do so that's another thing i'm going to work on is writing that all down i'm going to get off here before somebody walks in the bathroom and sees me recording myself you guys I did not have a good day at work, so I'm so glad to be home because I'm gonna go inside and work out and hopefully feel a little bit better because it was not a good day. I was just super overwhelmed with all I had to do and I'm just bleh right now, basically. So I'm not in the best mood, unfortunately. Breakfast, I had my overnight oats, which were really good. I thought I was gonna eat my fruit then, but I did not. So I just had my overnight oats for breakfast. Then for lunch, I had my pasta that I ended up making, which turned out pretty good. It was pretty simple, you know, just pasta with veggies and sausage. Pretty good. I mean, kind of higher in calorie for me, but, uh, you know, it was good. Then for my afternoon snack, which you guys know I always have a snack, basically between lunch and dinner, I had um, fruit. I had strawberries and grapes, which is good and filling. I'm full right now, so that's good go inside and change and work out and then I will basically have to do just half a dinner because I've had pork chops in the crock pot all day so that part's done I don't gotta do that so that's nice but I can hear Bowser barking it's probably driving in up the wall so I'm gonna go inside so I can get started on my evening and I'll talk to you guys later A hot mess right now but it's because I didn't shower as soon as I got done working out because I didn't sweat with today's workout this hair I swear I <laughs> just rhymed <laughs> um, I worked out and then I um, finished up dinner I made some Asian cauliflower rice and some steamed Asian veggies so I had that with my pork chops tonight so it was pretty good I'm not exactly sure 100% what the calorie count was on that I kind of estimated I think it was around 690 calories maybe a little less than that um but i had that and then afterwards i ended up finishing off one of the wink dessert ice cream things that i got a couple weeks ago but i added a little bit of liquid stevia and um powdered peanut butter to it to give it a little bit more flavor because i don't remember if you guys remember this but when i told you about it a couple weeks ago it just didn't have much flavor i was kind of weird so i actually threw it in my nutribullet and added some stevia and then afterwards added some powdered peanut butter and it tastes a little better so yay and then um i actually ended up having some dry roasted peanuts and um some leftover carrots because i was still feeling a little bit hungry and i know tomorrow i'm gonna be hungry if i didn't make sure i felt more full tonight obviously if that makes sense so 
that's kind of what I'm going to have to eat. I'm pretty sure I'm under my TDEE for the day, which is good, you know. Um, wanting to get back to that. Kind of want to focus on trying to eat even less calories. Kind of want to focus on different kinds of foods that are lower in calorie but higher in fibers and stuff like that to get me full faster if that makes sense. Um, you know, more protein and things like that just to make me feel more full but still keep the calorie count low enough if I can do that. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing right now. I'm so tired. I have to shower still, so I'm gonna get up here and do that. And um, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow morning. It's Friday, y'all. Yes, Friday. I'm excited that it's Friday. The end of the week is finally here, and um, I'm here for it, literally. <laughs> Today's fasting day. I hope I can make it through the day okay. Um, I feel fine now, but I know with this eating as much as I have, I'm afraid that my stomach today is going to be like, why aren't you feeding me? Where's my food? So I'm going to have to really push through today. And um, I have to push through today. I want to do a complete day of fasting like what I did earlier this week and really focus on continuing alternate day fasting to uh, lose the last bit of fat that I have. And um, of course I'm going to also work out still. Really push myself harder. I think I need to push myself harder on my workouts to... Uh, help with losing the fat so just some things got my coffee and my water i was gonna try to go like a week without coffee maybe i'll start that like next week or something to see just what the effects would have on my body i kind of rely on it to wake up in the morning so don't know about that <laughs> i'm gonna get up here so i can get started on my day i was really busy yesterday i had such a bad day so hopefully i can get completely caught up today and um not have such a bad day. Hopefully it'll be better. Actually, it's going to be a good day. Let's be positive here. It's going to be a good day. Guys, look how exciting this is. That's the only snow left on the porch. There's Bowser. Hi, Bowser. <laughs> um, I'm home. I went to the grocery store after work to pick up some things for the party we're having tomorrow. And um, I'm going to prepare some of the stuff tonight so that way I don't have to worry about it tomorrow and hopefully stay distracted and keep from eating. I feel like I've done a pretty good job today. I had two cups of coffee and one actually had a um, creamer in it which was 15 calories, but I'm pretty sure that's been burned off by now. So it's the only calorie intake I've had today. And um, I got through the day and I'm so grateful that I'm home now and I'm gonna go change into some comfortable, cozy pajamas and get warm because I'm cold. I'm wearing a skirt with tights. So I'm going to change. Hi, buddy. He says hello. Um, but yeah, I'm home. I'm going to put all my groceries away and prepare some of the stuff for tomorrow's party. So that way I don't have to worry about it. And um, like I said, stay distracted. Keep focused. Not eat. It's 6 o'clock now, so I only have a couple more hours until bedtime anyway. So as long as I stay driven, I should be good. I'm going to get off here. Talk to you guys later. It is 10:19. My kitchen is a disaster. We're not gonna look at it. And I just made two batches of um, mini cheesecakes for the party tomorrow. That will go in the fridge for overnight. So uh, there's that. <laughs> I also made cashew butter because I'm planning on making a chili con queso, a vegan chili con queso, and um, kind of pulled things out to see what else I can serve. I didn't want to buy a lot of stuff because I knew I had stuff that I could like give away or you know like set out here at home that we want to get rid of like cookies and stuff. So um, I'm planning on doing that. <laughs> but um, this evening was good. I did not eat besides licking the spoon a couple times, but I mean, how could you not, right? And um, besides that, I didn't, didn't take any other calories. So yay, I was able to make it through basically a full fasting day without eating any food, so good. I'm glad. I was hoping I could, and I did. And I thought it would be harder because yesterday I didn't feel like I was full whenever I got to the end of the day, but I've been chugging my water and just, you know, staying distracted. And isn't it weird that me cooking keeps me more distracted to eat food than, like, not? <laughs> I'm really tired, though. As always, I always say that at the end of every night vlog, you know, I say I'm always tired, but I am. So, I'm going to put away these last cheesecakes and go to bed and tomorrow's a new day. I already know I'm making waffles for breakfast. I love waffles. <laughs> <laughs>
Good morning, everybody. Happy Saturday. It's 9.30. I've already had my breakfast. Um, I actually had two things for breakfast, kind of, because I woke up and I couldn't stop thinking about making this strawberry banana protein smoothie that actually turned out really freaking good. So I had that as soon as I got up. And then I made myself a cup of coffee with cashew milk. And I tried making something with like uh, almond extract and honey, and I didn't like it. At all. I ended up adding liquid stevia to it because the honey added absolutely no sweetness and it was really weird. I don't know, it's not good, but I finished it. And then I made some vegan waffles and put peach preserves on them with some Lacanto syrup that came to 197 calories, so it was pretty low. I only had two of the waffles. The smoothie was 170. The coffee was 60 and then I had some mixed nuts as well. So I've kind of eaten a lot already this morning, but I don't want to eat anything extra now. I just came in here and chugged some water. Today is a workout day, so I know I'll burn my calories and everything that I've eaten has been, you know, like lower or healthier kind of. <laughs> Not really, but that's okay. I'm not too worried about it. We're having a party tonight, so honestly, calorie counting today isn't gonna really matter. We're doing a nacho bar for dinner. I need to kind of get ready. I'm meeting a friend. I'm gonna hang out with her a little bit this morning, and then um, I'm gonna go to my mom's for lunch. So I'm gonna kind of have a busier morning. Then I have to come back here, kind of help clean a little bit, pick up a little bit, because this bedroom is a disaster right now. It's still not completely organized after coming back from vacation. And um, then I'll work out and uh, get ready for the party. I have some more things I need to like do before then, some cutting of vegetables and prepping of toppings and stuff like that. So that's what will happen this afternoon. But I wanted to update you guys now and let you know what all was going on today. So I'm gonna get over here so I can get ready. And I will talk to you guys later. I've been running around like a chicken with my head cut off, but I'm finally ready for my party. Jesus. <laughs> and I am here for it. I'm gonna go in the bathroom because the music's loud. I don't wanna get copyrighted playing Drake. So I'm in my bathroom now. Anyway, busy day, got a lot done. Lunch, we had Popeye's chicken. It was delicious. Kind of went overboard more than I wanted to, but I had calories left. I came home, I worked out. I definitely have calories left, and I'm not counting tonight, obviously. I'm having a party with my friends. I want to enjoy myself, but I did good up until tonight, basically. <laughs> we're having a nacho bar, so I'm excited for that. I think everybody who is here already is hungry, so I don't know when we're going to start digging into that stuff, but hopefully soon. Um, and we're just going to enjoy ourselves and party. So I wanted to go ahead and vlog really quick before it got too late, and I wouldn't be able to do it later. So that is me doing that now. So I will talk to you guys tomorrow morning. It's 12 16. I got out of bed 45 minutes ago. I finally was able to sleep in today and it was glorious. I've been needing to sleep in and catch up on my rest for a while now and I finally was able to do it and it was amazing. <laughs> Party last night was fun. Um, basically, I think I stayed up till like 12, so you know, it wasn't like I slept a whole, you know, 14, 15 hours. It was more like a nine or nine and a half or something but it was really nice and um like i said the party went well we had a bunch of people over we just talked and had a good time i ended up going to bed earlier than everybody we ended up having another snowy day thing happen say hi <laughs> more snow i'm over it i want to move to florida i moved move to nashville where we can eat fried chicken every day. And um, yeah, so everybody left pretty early last night. And I just got up and we're kind of cleaning up after the party. And um, I have some things I want to do today. I need to go through my 99 plus Instagram messages, answer those, pull out some questions and film some of those questions and put them on my new Instagram blog idea that I want to do the mini episodes of answering questions. So that way I can get those like pre-recorded and posted a couple times a week because I think that'd be good to get out there. It just takes a lot of time. So that's why I'm procrastinating. But uh, that's what's happening today. 
I'm glad it's Sunday and we can kind of chill before we have to go back to work tomorrow. Next week is gonna feel super long just because I've not had a full week of work in a really long time. So I'm gonna get off here and finish cleaning the kitchen and I will talk to you guys later on today. Well, I've hardly talked to you guys at all today, which is kind of my fault, but um, I've been kind of going through all my Instagram messages and answering all those. I finally did my first Instagram mini-sode um, that I put up on my channel or my Instagram channel, if that makes sense. And um, I meal prepped. I made some chili for work tomorrow for lunch. Ian had like two servings for dinner and he's taking a bowl to work tomorrow. So we got that figured out and taken care of, I guess. Um, for lunches tomorrow and um, what else have I done today? I don't know. It feels like I've been busy all day long. Um, kind of got in a down mood about myself earlier today which sucks because you guys know how much I hate being in moods like that but it happens so often. I'm at this milestone I guess. I don't even know what I would say and I'm probably bloated from all the food that I had yesterday but I just feel like I'm not seeing any progress or difference. So I have some goals I wanna work on, work towards here um, as we go into March. This will be month 18 of intermittent fasting for me, which means I've been doing it for a year and a half now, which is crazy. I'm just afraid I'm gaining weight back, which I know is muscle weight, but I'm freaking myself out thinking I'm gaining fat back and I need to calm down and stop thinking about stuff like that and just keep striving and reaching towards my goal. At this point, I know I'm not going to get down to 120. Like, there's no way I'm getting down to 120 with the amount of working out that I'm doing. But, um, I really need to focus on the amount that I'm eating, try to figure out what my accurate TDE is, and just kind of try to stick to it. Um, I've been so up and down and all over the place here recently just because I'm eating you know, to be full and stuff like that. And then I have people tell me, don't count calories on your fasting days. You don't need to because you're in a calorie deficit anyways. And I don't know, it's weird. I'm trying to transition and change my lifestyle again. And I mean, I've been doing the same thing for so long now that thinking about changing it again is just so hard to me. But today I did good, I didn't eat, didn't have any calories, um, so there's that. But I'm gonna try to make a list, I think of uh, goals for March going into this new month and try to stick to those and go from there. I'll let you guys know what those goals are tomorrow or on next week's vlog. I guess you guys will find out. It was a good weekend, I had a good party. Um, today was cold and all that stuff, but I didn't go anywhere, which was kind of nice. Ian bought me a medicine ball today because I asked him to look for one at Walmart because I want to start trying to do some high intensity interval training with um, a medicine ball you know or whatever and I've seen a lot of um, exercises done with those and I really love them so they're so pricey that's the part that sucks about them I don't really have too much else to talk about today or a weekend I hope everybody was fun and great and fantastic or whatever but it's like 10 o'clock for me now so I need to go to bed so I can get a good night's sleep before work tomorrow and all that jazz so I'm gonna let you guys go and say Thank you so much for stopping by and watching this week's vlog. Really appreciate it. Bowers and I really appreciate it. <laughs> and we will catch you on. Tomorrow.